Good afternoon, welcome to my channel. Um, today I am going to be reviewing these Tim Holtz journaling cards. I saw somebody using them on their channel recently and I thought, well, they look quite good. So I got a pack off Amazon, which I will link down below. And I thought I would open them and show you guys what they're all like. Because the picture I got was just that. So I've got no idea what they're like or anything like that. Right, so first off, each size, there's several different, there's 25 of each size, apparently. And they are all stuck together. <laughs> each size, size is individually wrapped and they are stuck together. So those are your, your four sizes. They come in 3.25 inch by 2.125 inch, which I assume are these little ones here. Then you've got 3.25 by 3.25 square. Then you've got 3.25 by 4.25. Then you've got the big ones, which are 3.25 by 6.25. I like those. We will look at those ones last. We'll do them in order of sizes. So let's try the little ones. These are cute. So what I'm gonna do is, I was hoping to see if I could get the sticky off, but it doesn't look like it wants to come off. It's a bit annoying it would have been an ideal way to sort of store them the bags are actually quite strong they're not those flimsy little crappy bags now I, I don't have a lot of Tim Holtz stuff okay so this is completely completely new for me um, first impressions not bad at all not bad at all it's not unbendable you can bend them okay the color is nice so I'll go through them bit by bit. So this one, we've got a shipment collect with a lovely map in the background. I really, really like that one. With a plain bit on the back. Like a shipping sort of label. I need to be more in focus, don't I? Let me just get that up for you. Hang on. There we go. My hands are a bit dry. I've been tea dyeing paper, so. And that's just got like a plain label type thing on the back. Then we've got this tag. I like that. And that's got that on the back. <gasps> a typewriter. Oh, typewriter guys, typewriter. My hands are dry and it's all sticking together. And that's just got that on the back, sort of graph paper with that design. That's nice. Oh, I can see me using these. <laughs> I'm just getting into the world of junk journals, so this is all completely new for me. Oh, very nice. There's not a single one that I haven't liked yet. And you can use these as little tags, as journaling cards, anything like that. <laughs> and that has like a little ledger or a test result or something there school month yes it's a school test like reading spelling writing drawing language or so that's grammars and grammar physical and hygiene so yeah, a whole list of stuff awesome school type stuff which is great if you've got kiddies going into school oh I like that one sewing pattern that's cool type right keyboard that's nice I like that a lot Diary, 
tie on. I like them. I think I would probably keep them in the wee bags, even though they're all st sticky. You know, because the glue dot doesn't come off. That's about the only thing I don't like so far, is that the glue dot doesn't come off. I like that they are packaged individually size-wise, but yeah, the, the glue dot where it was stuck to another packet is, uh, I can't get it off. So these ones are like, they look like beer mats to me. <laughs> these seem thinner. I don't know if it's just me or what. But... Yeah, they're not hugely robust, you know, they're not very thick, but they are, um, heavier than paper, a heavier weight than paper, that's nice. I like it that some of them are really, really plain on the other side. And I suppose you could use these as little tuck spots or oh flips or things, I don't know. really hard to find somewhere to rest my elbow. It keeps everything in shot. My camera won't zoom down quite that far. Beautiful that writing. Really, really beautiful.
I'm seeing some repeats, you know, like the one with the lovely writing. That's I've seen that three times now, and it's the same section of writing. Um, it's the same words. But they're nice, I like them, so I'm not really that bothered. I would probably use um, a softer pen on these, like a fountain pen or something, because I think a ballpoint pen or a biro or a rollerball or something like that would um, dent the paper. And if that kind of thing bothers you, you might want to think about what kind of pen you're using on them. Marker. Oh, come on, get the packet. And these are the big ones. <laughs> They're great size. I love that one. I have to move my hand a little bit further away. Focus right. Oops. So yeah, these are the bigger ones. I'm glad they've not all got the line stuff on the back. Although I wouldn't want to cover any of these up so that I could journal on them. <laughs> Just too lovely. And these are okay because you can just write straight on the back of them. But the ones where they've got a lovely pat on both sides, it's sort of like, uh, the fuck am I going to do? See? Uh, uh, uh. At least that's got something on the back. I mean, you could journal there on that, which is great. a darker pen I think if you want to journal on it Similar to that. Beautiful, beautiful copy. 
the boat writing. I know these are ever so slightly out of focus, but I just can't get them in the right focus there. Very, very, very nice. I like all of those. I can see me using these in my new junk journal, which I'm making. That's if I don't get all, um, oh, they're just too beautiful, you know? Because <laughs> I can see me doing that as well. Yeah, very, very, very nice indeed. Um, this wasn't overly expensive, I don't think. I got it on Amazon UK, and I pay, I'm sure it's Amazon. I got it on. Oh, nope, it wasn't. So, which means it must have been eBay then. I paid less than ten pounds for them, so there you go. Not too expensive at all. Um, would I recommend them? Yeah, yeah, I think I would. I'm going to use them. So there you go. I hope you liked this review. Sorry about the wonky mat underneath. Um, thank you so much for joining me. Please feel free to give this video a thumbs up. Um, leave us a comment down below if you click the book over here in the corner you will be subscribed and if you hit the bell that appears down below that you will be notified when i upload new content thank you so much for joining me today i really do appreciate it take it easy guys